Welcome to Akhand Vidyashram, the first institute of impeccable wisdom. Sutra 6, Secondary Education, the third three years of my life. My mission, the impeccable wisdom, knowing which everything is fully known. My discovery of impeccable wisdom is Divyank, the divine design of nature, with which the perfect objects are designed and created. 1965, for excellent academic results to get into medical college, I joined Sri Ranveer Multilateral Higher Secondary School, Jammu, Prague. The school is known for the golden sections to train students for top positions or ranks in the Jammu and Kashmir Board of Secondary Education. Since I had scored the highest marks in Katra School, I was made the monitor of the golden section 9A. Now, First three months was absolute bliss, enjoying to the core. But after three day, three months, the first challenge of my life actually came. One day, our chemistry teacher punished a student. Somehow, Mr. Narsimhan, the farm teacher, wanted me to complain about the teacher to this principal. Since the teacher was honest and right, he had not made any mistake. I refused to complain to the principal about the teacher. Result, I was summarily dismissed as a monitor. Thereafter, I was treated like an untouchable person and glad that farm teacher started exhibiting his true colors, true nature. Anyway, I will not like to go into details of uh, the what happened thereafter. I think I'll leave it at that. It was a very great, it was a great lesson ki, even with on honesty and trusted, you are going to be tested at every stage. If you are honest, truthful, merit-based, and I think you have nothing to worry about it. You can pass all the tests. This, after the particular problem, farm teacher who was teaching us maths and English refused to correct my papers and wouldn't even say whether my answers were right or wrong. It was very unfortunate, very pathetic uh, state of affairs, but anything, it was a challenge for me to prove worthy that I'm, I cannot be cowed down by anyone for that matter. Then there's a law of divine justice. Year 1966, final examination, the principal ordered a secret centralized evaluation. Our papers were corrected by teachers from other uh, sections. And they had absolutely no ideas whose paper this is. The result, I got the record breaking marks again. As a routine, I was posted into medical section 10A by default. Principal wanted me to join golden section 10K, hoping that golden section could help me to get first position in higher secondary court. Sri Suraj Prakash Rana, the farm teacher of medical section 10A, where I was allotted, requested me not to go to the golden section. I agreed and started listening to every word of all the teachers with the consultation and contemplation. Everybody was very keen that we can do it, we will do it. Then a golden opportunity for me to put into experiment something which I had learnt in Katra school. There is one Hindi couplet, Saraswati ke bandhar mein badi apura baat, juju kharche tiyutu bade vin kharche gatiyat. It means the treasure of Saraswati, the goddess of knowledge, is very peculiar. More and more we spent our share, more and more it grows. Unlike Lakshmi, the goddess of wealth, more and more we spend, less and less it grows. But in knowledge, knowledge grows as we start sharing. So I got a golden opportunity to learn and sharing whatever I have learned in a new experiment. And there will lay a foundation for Akhand Vidya also. Arun Kumar Sharma was my batchmate. Believe it, up to ninth standard, he was just an average student. But when, by divine grace, he happened to be my benchmate, sat next to me, and whatever I learnt, I taught the same to Arun. 
it was a golden opportunity for me also to reinforce the knowledge into my brain at the same time teach him at the same time i am thankful that we found a good team result i got the bre record breaking 532 marks in the higher secondary core examination of jammu and kashmir board of secondary education srinagar arun kumar sharma was the second with 504 marks surprisingly everyone else got less than 500 marks i just can't believe there could be so much difference but of course i had seen that in katra so it was not a big surprise at it was not a shock anyway i am grateful to shri surut prakash rana ji and other teachers of 10a for their guidance and my success or rather our success here i would like to put in record results gazette which joint secretary of the board was kind enough to give me as a compliment when i had approached him for results and here you can see the proof ke i have got 532 arun kumar got 504 but i you can see that my name was shivlal sharma at that particular stage my father had given it as that because everyone in the family had lal sharma as a last name but my actual name is bhushan everybody knows me as a bhushan so after graduation i saw to it that my name changed from shivlal sharma to shibushin sharma standard 11 higher secondary elective i again refused to join the golden section result i got a good record breaking marks again in medical students of course the question of getting first position in the board was not possible because medical non medical students having mathematics they can get 200 out of 200 for a medical student to get 200 out of 200 is just not possible by virtue of subject i literally had to settle down to further down but first among the medical student as a, by virtue of being the top medical student i was awarded the national merit scholarship because i was a position holder anyway may not be the first but top position holders i was also selected for one of the two medical seats in tamil nadu i am also glad that school laid the foundation for empirical wisdom by giving me a certificate provisional certificate with a conduct and character as an exemplary getting a certificate exemplary conduct character in school speaks volumes i wonder how many people have got it but now i know if i was an example for katra school if i an example for jammu school then i have to be example for rest of my life too so this so the seeds of exemplary impeccable wisdom in my brain then i love to work towards achieving the pinnacles of my life and i am glad i had never expected such an exemplary academic start in my life in school itself laid a great foundation math physics chemistry biology english and other subjects now i had to build on to the medical subjects later anyway life has been wonderful and i'm sure things would improve as i start working on it thank you very much for listening and encouraging